The Grief of a Girl's Heart by Lady Gregory Read for LibriVox.org by Elizabeth Clett O Donal Og, if you go across the sea, bring myself with you and do not forget it, and you will have a sweetheart for fair days and market days, and the daughter of the King of Greece beside you at night. It is late last night. The dog was speaking of you. The snipe was speaking of you in her deep marsh. It is you are the lonely bird through the woods, and that you may be without a mate until you find me. You promised me, and you said a lie to me, that you would be before me where the sheep are flocked. I gave a whistle and three hundred cries to you, and I found nothing there but a bleeding lamb. You promised me a thing that was hard for you, a ship of gold under a silver mast, twelve towns with a market in all of them, and a fine white court by the side of the sea. You promised me a thing that is not possible, that you would give me gloves of the skin of a fish, that you would give me shoes of the skin of a bird, and a suit of the dearest silk in Ireland. O oh, Donal Og, it is I would be better to you than a high, proud, spendthrift lady. I would milk the cow, I would bring help to you, and if you were hard-pressed, I would strike a blow for you. O oh, Achon, and it's not with hunger or with wanting food, or drink, or sleep that I am growing thin, and my life is shortened, but it is the love of a young man has withered me away. It is early in the morning that I saw him coming, going along the road on the back of a horse. He did not come to me. He made nothing of me. And it is on my way home that I cried my fill. When I go by myself to the well of loneliness, I sit down and I go through my trouble, when I see the world and do not see my boy, he that has an amber shade in his hair. It was on that Sunday I gave my love to you, the Sunday that is last before Easter Sunday, and myself on my knees reading the Passion, and my two eyes giving love to you for ever. O oh, I, my mother, give myself to him, and give him all that you have in the world. Get out yourself to ask for alms, and do not come back and forward looking for me. My mother said to me not to be talking with you today, or tomorrow, or on the Sunday. It was a bad time she took for telling me that. It was shutting the door after the house was robbed. My heart is as black as the blackness of the slow, or as the black coal that is on the smith's forge, or as the sole of a shoe left in white halls. It was you put that darkness over my life. You have taken the east from me. You have taken the west from me. You have taken what is before me, and what is behind me. You have taken the moon. You have taken the sun from me. And my fear is great, that you have taken God from me. End of poem this recording is in the public domain.